Chapman, and thanks for coming in, Sue. And of course, there is one dominating story. <laughs> but let's start with the, uh, the Daily Mail. What are they saying about this? Well, absolutely. Um, there really is no avoiding this, this uh, extremely embarrassing row. And um, the Daily Mail uh, is absolutely going for the jugular as far as they're concerned. You know, this is going to be the last straw for Jackie Smith and it's only a matter of time before she finally crawls, crawls away. Um, but how long do they give her? They, they're, they, they're saying. They're, what they're saying is it could, be a, it could be a matter of months. A matter of months. So right. don't hold your breath. I don't think it's going to happen anytime soon. So who's saying that uh, she could face the axe? Do they, do they tell us that on the front page or not? No. Uh, Sources? No, they're not, they're not, really, they're not really saying who's, who's calling for her head. Um, but uh, I think that, um, that the relish with which they're reporting the story really does, does uh, you know, it, it does show that, that uh, the paper has its own interests at heart there, I think, Perhaps has a little bit not, of its own agenda not playing with that one. Uh, let's move on then to the, uh, the Telegraph, I think. Yes, well, the, the Telegraph has come up with an absolutely spectacular amount of detail on this story, which is, is as, as you would expect, from the, the paper of record. And, um, uh, yes, the headline, Smith shamed as expenses sleaze row engulfs labour, and, and here in the small print, they've obviously set a team of reporters to find out the, quest the answers to the question which the nation is is uh, is asking tonight, which is, what were those movies? <laughs> <laughs> that Mr. And did they get Smith an answer? Was enjoying that night. Well, they have combed the schedules, and um, they don't actually say that these are the titles that he was watching. However, they do share with us that uh, one of these uh, adult channels, Television X, was showing that night two particular movies. One was Raw Meat 3 and the other by special request. So um, Do they, don't, they don't go into the detail and review these they, films and no, tell they, us whether no, it was worth the money no, sadly, and sadly worth not. all the trouble. Yes, apparently he also watched Ocean's 13 twice. Which some would say and have said today is a, is a worse crime in no, some respects. Absolutely, I think we all deserve such a poor an, film. an apology <laughs> for that one. <laughs> Uh, on to the Independent, is that the next one? Um, well, I've got the, the Guardian, Guardian here, Guardian. and yeah. um, again, on the front page, um, a close-up here of uh, Jackie Smith looking extremely fed up, as, as well she might be. They've probably got the best headline, which is two blue movies, one domestic row, and red faces all round. Um, but they've chosen to actually to lead, uh, not with that, but with, um, with the G20, a kind of a where we are where we are now at the end of at the end of the weekend before the summit next week. Um, ju just asking you yourself on the Jackie Smith issue, uh, how damaging do you think it is for her? I mean, there's all this coverage, and we've had it uh, all today as well. Yes. 